Hey, we're still in Rock Tunnel, but we're about to leave after we fight this person. So I'm so ready to get out of here and lay my dead Pokemon to rest. Fitting, because we're going to Lavender Town. Yup. Uh, Gust! To the graveyard we will go, la 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 la. Uh-oh. Alright, good, it didn't work. It didn't work! No! No, it's a good thing. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa? Whoa! What's the last one? It's a Pidgey! I think that Pidgey is screwed. It is fighting a six levels higher Pidgeotto. Nice. Named Team Force. Oh, you're gonna gust me back. It's a Pitch. gust battle. This is like K.O. Ken Kamehameha versus your Gallic Gun. It's got nothing on it. Bam! All right. I'm a little bit disheartened because we lost two Pokemon in this tunnel. Yeah. All right, let's get out of here. We just got to go down and we'll finally be out. I'm not even looking at the map anymore. I remember this from as a kid. You get through that hallway with the two picnickers and you are in the clear. So let's get clear out of here and never, ever return. Mm -hmm. We are never going through Rock Tunnel again. There's not a reason to. Oh my gosh, please don't tell me I have to fight any of these people. Oh god. Hi, do I have to fight you? Fuck. No. Oh, you're feeling a bit faint? Please, faint. Dear god, we don't want to fight you. You don't know the meaning of fainting. You better faint. Your face is faint? I can barely see your nose. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well, that takes care of that. What's next? Oh, you went up from Pidgey to Pidgeotto. Allow me to show you my Wolverine claws. Blitz pow! Rawr. Let's do it one more time. Blitz pow! You are dead. You know what Pokemon needs another evolution? Whoa, they give me 500 XP. What? Sand Slash. Well, what they are doing is um, the Alola form, that's Ice type. Well, that's not a real evolution. They need to either make an evolution or a mega evolution of Sand Slash. I don't think they're going to make new mega evolutions. No, but that's fun. They're just like, nah, we got a, we got a lowland forms now. I really like mega evolutions. Yeah, not we... not because they're like OP, cuz that's really annoying, but they look really cool. And that's all I care about in these games. What apparently. looks cool? <laughs> what looks what cool? What looks cool? I mean, come on. Have you seen how I play? Yes, I have. Audience hasn't. <laughs> no, they haven't. But basically, my team is always made up of whoever looks the fucking coolest. Damn it, I don't have low kick to deal with Onyxes anymore. Ugh. Damn. Dig it up! Bam! D dig it up, dig it up, yo. D d dig it up, yo. Dig dig it, dog, dig, dig it up. Dig it up, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Did you ever see that movie? What's, what movie is holes. that? Have you seen Holes? Yes, I've seen the Holes. That's the, like, music that they oh, had Oh, I forgot. Very I holes. haven't seen it since I was in, like, sixth grade. Dude, we need to watch it again, because I really like that movie. I remember it being a good movie. It was, it was one of those movies, like, when I was a kid, that was like, oh, this is so in-depth and deep and really cool, but also funny and entertaining and totally, like... For my kind of kid, because I, I was a kid that liked smart movies, and it was. Why are there so many smart. trainers between Rock Tunnel and Lavender Town? One of my like best friends in elementary school was really into holes as well. Oh was god, like, this is my last movie. dig! Oh crap! This Man, is really you're just bad. Having a hard time. This is really bad. I don't have like anything to fight an Onyx with after this dig. Like, it's going to be resistant to every other kind of attack I could do, besides mm. uh, NCS's bite. Okay, we're just going to have to potion and slash. Or Aether, Icran Girl's uh, Vine Whip. I'd hate to do that when we're so close. My hope is that I'm going to use slash and get crits on it, because it has a high critical hit ratio, and just power through this thing. There we go! Boom. It's really good. Oh, uh, it's hardening. Damn it. Stop hardening. Okay, if we don't kill it with these seven slashes. Oh, there we go. Crit oh, okay. Critical hit not only does, like, double damage, it also breaks through all defense buffs. Oh, thank God for it being on our side this time. God damn it, it's a graveler. Fuck balls. I'm going upstairs. Fuck balls. Oh, I'm going upstairs. 
Oh, I've been screeched too. It's not very effective. Oh. Okay. Well, here we go, kids. Slash and Growlers with my claws. Slash and Growlers with Seamus' claws. Slash and Growlers. I'm, I'm pretty sure that is exactly how the Sailor Moon song goes. Did you know one of my co-workers dressed up as Sailor Moon for Halloween? Oh no, that's cool. Yeah. I, I would tell you who it is, but that would be irrelevant information to the audience. So. Yeah, okay. But it's totally the person you think it would be. Alyssa? Yes. Okay. Yeah, she, she totally was awesome with that costume. It was so hard not to geek out like really crazy. All right, please tell me there's no more trainers on the way back to on the way to Lavender Town. I really can't fight anything else. Oh, hello, trainer. <laughs> oh. Don't, don't. What? Oh, wait, you can't. I'm just, like... I'm just checking my surroundings. Oh, I thought you were trying to avoid him. I'm like, no, don't go down. I could probably find a way to He's avoid him if I was you. really careful. Oh god, it's a Pokemaniac too. They always have like rare good Pokemon. No. Just a Cubone. Well, okay, most of Cubone's attacks aren't gonna hit Team Four Star, because ground attacks don't hit flying types, so that's good. We've got a good matchup. Oh god, headbutt hurts. Okay. Yeah, head to the butt does hurt. Especially if you're wearing a skull on your head. Oh, that sounds awful. Calcium! To the butts. Alright. Bam. Alright, he's got one you know, more. Those Cubones look really bored. <laughs> yeah. Uh, like, meh. Yeah, I, could, I guess I can fight. I guess I could whack you with my bone. Okay, how'd the Slowpoke look? He looks exactly he's, as a Slowpoke should. He looks, he looks a little not there. Hey. I would... Use other words to describe him, but that will piss people off. <laughs> so I won't. Because I'm relatively PC like that, which is total bullshit. <laughs> uh, Bam. Oh, I'm dead. Slow pokes. I love slow pokes. They're. Oh something. no, my Pokemon. Oh. We should find. Oh, we're in lavender. Let's heal. We should adopt a dog that looks like a slow poke. Oh man, we got two dead Pokemon to deposit. Aww. <sighs> we should put little gravestones okay. on them. Okay. Goodbye, Proton John. You are such a great tank with all of your HP. I wish you could have lived, because we have the Moonstone to make you a wiggly tub. He looks so happy. You can hang out with all your friends. <laughs> And, and, I'm gonna, you... and you're going to be joined by Cockbite, who was definitely one of my favorites. I love having fighting Pokemon Aww. on the team. Maybe you know... maybe we'll we'll put an Ego Raptor to to carry on your legacy. You thank know... you thank you for beating the first gym for us, Cockbite. You have you just need one more Pokemon to die, and you'll have a full team. I'll have a dead team. You should you should do a playthrough with Team Dead. <laughs> Yeah, I'm allowed to use them in Lavender Town. <laughs> yeah. Team Ghost. Ooh. Ghost Buster. I don't want to replace anyone yet because I think there's some more grass on the left where we haven't caught anything. And so I just want to see all my options before I officially, like, replace somebody. Do I have to fight? I don't think this is a trainer, but we'll try to avoid her just in case. Oh, fuck. Well, fine, if he's that hellbent on fighting us. What's a cute round fluffy Pokemon name? My dead Proton John, you bitch. <laughs> I don't want to even see your ass. That's not going to make up for it. Oh, it's a Clefairy. <laughs> All right. Bam. That's right, everyone. There's no way you're going to make someone feel better by showing your ass. <laughs> Especially if you make a joke about their dead Pokemon. Hey, guess what? Your Proton John is dead. Neener, neener, neener. It doesn't matter how much of a jerk you are. Showing your ass ain't gonna cut it. Okay, it's great that you're using Follow Me Clefairy. I won't be able to do anything about it till I wake up. If you remember, you put me to sleep. Follow me. 
set me free. Trust me when we, we will, will escape, escape from the, the city. I'll make it through. Follow, follow me. me. Set fuck your minimize. Didn't help you at all. What else do you got? Rally boys. Well, hello there, Clefairy. How would you like a little gust? Gust of wind. <laughs> gust of earth, wind, and fire. I wish I could make voices like that. Pania, say that you remember. But no, I can just get my voice really high and obnoxious. Hmm. Like this! Haha! <laughs> I say, you sound just like Poir from Dragon Ball. I'm fucking Poir! <laughs> Poir, turn into a giant pair of scissors and cut off Goku's tail. <laughs> I was gonna say something, but now I'm laughing. <laughs> Fuck you, Yamcha! Hey, screw you! I don't have to feed you, you know. I can feed myself, bitch. Yeah, good luck. <laughs> that wasn't very good. All right. It's really well, hard. Let's, we'll just do let's plays from now. Oh, cool wing attack. We'll just do Let's Plays from now on as Yamcha and Poir. Most exciting thing ever. <laughs> yeah. Well, Team Four Star got better. She just got Wing Attack. I haven't caught something from this route already, right? Like, on the other side? I don't think that would be possible, but let me check the map just to be sure. Um, bag. Uh, town map. Where are we? Uh, we didn't- no, we haven't- we haven't gone on Route 8 yet, so there's no way we caught something here yet. Mm -mm. Alright. Well, I don't want to fight too many trainers, so let's just cut this grass and catch something right here. Cutting grass. Uh, I guess we'll try to catch it with Icran Girl, since she has Sleep Powder. Now, despite my kind of preconceived rule, even if I catch something here, I'm not going to necessarily add it to the team. It's just something to get. Okay, well, we can't get uh, that. We already have one of those. So wait, if your Pokemon died, can you catch another of that no. same type? No, 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 no. Darn no, it. No, no, no. You can't just have a replacement Pokemon. Don't we already have a Meowth? Yeah, we have a Meowth yeah, named Azure Blade. Oh, hey! It's, uh, it's... <laughs> oh, we can't escape from your Azure Blade. Of course, you would never want to leave him. This one has payday. Where, are you serious? It's eight levels below me. Why can't I run from it? I don't care how slow and immobile a Weepin' Bell is. It's an eight level below me Meowth. It's bullshit. Just let me run away from the freaking Pokemon that's nearly ten below me. Nah. Okay, that's a Pidgey. Fucking Pidgeys. We can't catch a Pidgey. I, I'm almost positive there's new stuff here for us to catch. I want to say this is the grass where you can get, like, Growlithe or Vulpix, but maybe not. Mm. If it is, it'd be cool. We don't have a fire type. Oh, ah! there we go! Although, since it is a fire type, we probably should not be using Icran Girl after all. Can I have it? Can you have it? No, it's I, mine. I want the Vulpix. I've always wanted a Vulpix. Uh-oh. Oh. Ow, boy. That's bad. It's got Will-O-Wisp. Shit. Okay, how much is the burn doing to me? Almost ten? Okay. <sighs> Oh, okay! Oh, hmm. Good job, Team Four Star! Please don't hurt it anymore! But, but burn me! Ha! Revenge! Okay. Pokeball, go! Let's catch a Vulpix. We're gonna get a Vulpix. That's yeah, that's a pretty good replacement. Yeah. I think we'll use it after all. I mean, it might become a Ninetales, and that's fabulous. Yeah. I so I guess Vulpix. Growlithe's you get in Fire Red, and Vulpix's you get in Leaf Green. I think that's how it works. In any case... Uh, we named the Machop Ego Raptor, so of course the Vulpix is named John Tron. <laughs> After I had actually never even heard of John Tron until Game Grumps, I'd never heard of the guy. But ever since I found him on Game Grumps, oh my gosh, John Tron for me is a must-watch now. I oh, yeah. have to watch every single video that John puts out. And you know what? He takes so long to put videos out that when he does put them out, they do feel like events, and it's very fantastic, and it's a special day that you must watch it. So cool. We have we have John Tron the Vulpix. So honestly, the the, the next thing is going to be just training up the team, because we got two new team members. We got to catch up with the rest, and that's a lot of catch up. Um, so who else are we going to add? I have an idea of who, but I want to double check. Hmm. Yeah, I think in the long run, it's going to be most beneficial for us 
Um, oh boy, or do I want to add Eagle Raptor so that we have another fighting type on the team? Wait, wait, wait until you can have both Eagle Raptor and John Tron. That's exactly what team. that's exactly what the scenario is right now, hon. Oh. But I'm trying to think about what we need. That's good against electric. We already have two flying types, which you don't really need, but I don't want to really... really good against that we don't already have something. I guess flying? Uh, Let me think. Uh, We're going to fight Erica, which is obviously why we want Jontron. But... What about... I mean, Electric's still a pretty good typing down. No, you know what? I want Electric, because we're going to be fighting our rivals Gyarados. And without, uh, without an Electric type... Without an Electric type Pokemon, Gyaradoses are scary. Yeah. So we're going to take Game Grump with us. It's kind of weird. We have Game Grump and Jontron. You know, I guess it works. Because John Tron's, Tron's not a member of Game Grumps anymore. So you know what? We have all three of the main Grumps represented here. This represents Eagle Raptor and Danny. This represents Jontron. And, you know, everyone Great. else on the show. There is no one else. That's Steam Train. <laughs> oh, yeah. Choo choo. Choo choo. We don't need Ross. We might get Susie later because she's pretty cool. You know, I would love to meet Susie. She's awesome. Actually, I um, I once sent um an email to Susie and she actually responded. So ever since then, I was like, hey, you know, this person's pretty cool. She's cool. She's awesome. All right, what moves do you guys have right now, John Tron and Game Grump? John Tron, you have no fire moves, you piece of shit. No, he, she has one. All it does is burn. It doesn't actually hurt anything. Burning hurts. Okay. It doesn't have a fire type attack that'd be used for the usage that fire types attack actually have. Like, I oh. can't breathe fire and stuff and do damage. All I can do is burn. At least it can roar. That doesn't hurt. The only attack this <laughs> thing has is quick attack. <laughs> Game Grump doesn't even have an electric move yet. Well, I guess you gotta work on that then. Oh my god, this grinding session is going to be tedious. It's gonna be tedious. <laughs> How long did it take you to think of that? <laughs> Two brain cells. Okay, I don't want to do the I don't want to do the grinding yet. We're gonna do that next episode. So I'm gonna go ahead and explore this town. But we definitely want to train these two up before we go to, to Pokemon Tower because that's where we gotta fight the rival. That's odd. Mr. Fuji isn't here. Where'd he go? Yeah, he's probably asleep somewhere. This is really Mr. Fuji's house. He's really kind. He looks after abandoned and orphan Pokemon. It's so warm. Pokemon are so nice to hug. Aww. Until Sorry! <laughs> Sorry, Is he Huck. trying to hug that poor Psyduck? Yes. He's <laughs> trying to hug. <laughs> oh, uh, seriously, this isn't a Nidoran. It's a Gao. 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 What's his book say? Pokemon fan magazine. Great. Perfect. Useless. What's down here? I can catch more shit? If you have a pool. Okay, I don't want to experiment and explore too much. I want to raise up Jontron and, and Game Grump of reasonable levels. Those horrible rockets, they deserve no mercy. This pure Cubone's mother, it was killed trying to escape from Team Rocket. Yeah, oh, Pokemon what? was straight up murdered by Team Rocket. Damn. It, that's, gen, that's Gen 1 for you. They didn't beat around the bush. That's this Cubone's mom odd. is dead. And with that, we'll see you guys next episode. Wow.